A lot of things have been said, and uh, a lot have been very hurtful. I mean, I feel like I should just address the elephant in the room. It's an elephant that won't stop growing as Shannon Doherty hits back at Alyssa Milano. I've been thrown a lot of curveballs. Over Alyssa's reaction to comments Shannon and former Charmed co-star Holly Marie Combs made about her. You can't stay mad at me forever. I think back to that time, um, it was hard for me. It was hard for me. But as Shannon tells it, not as hard as her ousting from the series after three seasons. And I, I think we all know I'm talking about uh, Shannon's podcast and Holly and Shannon doing it together. I think I cried every single night of season two. Shannon taking to her Let's Be Clear podcast last year, where Holly alleged that Alyssa was behind her exit. There was a lot going on behind the scenes. Shannon and Holly reuniting in real life over the weekend at Megacon in Florida, joined by Rose McGowan, who replaced Shannon on the Witchy series. I think it's been very upfront and um, taken accountability for and apologize for whatever part I played in the situation. Alyssa took the same stage just the day before the trio, and while she didn't outright deny the firing claims, there is no revisionist history happening. Shannon went in on everything Alyssa did say about their behind the scenes drama. There is no brush flinging or shoe flinging. There is no lateness to set. There is no mediator for months on end. I recall the facts as if I were still living in them. How is your relationship now? I would say we are cordial. I say I would say we have respect, people change, mm -hmm. things change. Um, you know, I can take responsibility for a lot of our, our tension that we had. Alyssa opening up to ET in 2021, looking back on the hit show that ran for eight seasons, a legacy everyone agrees is tainted by the ongoing feud. I'm the most sad that a show that has meant so much to so many people, um, has been tarnished by a toxicity, toxicity that is still, to this day, almost a quarter of a century later, still happening. We were always made to feel like we were in competition with one another because there was only, you know, room for, for one corner office, right? And I have some guilt about my part in that. And it is only through my battle with cancer that I decided to address this trauma and be open and honest about it. As for Shannon's ongoing battle with stage four cancer, Alyssa seemed to reference that on the gram, pinning a message for her three former co-stars as their war of words shows no sign of slowing down. That's heartbreaking, it's hard. I wish Holly, Shannon, and Rose peace and light in their personal and professional journeys. We all have bigger demons to fight. When you go back and you watch the show now, does do, you still love those characters, right? You still so much. love that show. Oh my God, so much, so much. I think that show is very important 